Piers Morgan Live, breaking news tonight. A Malaysia Airlines plane carrying 239 people bound for Beijing is missing. Dan penerbangan MH370 Kuala Lumpur, Beijing terputus hubungan dengan menara kawalan. A search is underway for a Malaysia Airlines jet which has gone missing Masih on a flight. Belum dapat mengesan MH370 yang hilang. My name is Grace and my mother was on MH370. My name is Jaquita and uh, my husband was the in-flight supervisor for MH370. His name was Patrick Gomez. So we're approaching three years now since the plane went missing and unfortunately we're nowhere different from where we started. We've not moved anywhere. All we know is that the plane disappeared on the 8th of March three years ago and it's still missing. There hasn't been a change in the situation. We still don't know why the last words we heard from the plane were Good night, Malaysia. We don't know why the plane turned around. We don't know why it flew. Hours, of course. We don't know why it never reached its destination. That's the answer. We still don't know. So Voice 370 is an organization. We represent the families of the passengers and crew on board MH370. It is a, a very good support group for anyone, the passenger, families and also the crew. We do, we do mix once in a while, not only to talk about the missing plane, but also as a support um, emotionally. Only the people in Voice 370 know exactly what we feel like, so they're the only people who are in exactly the same position as us. No one else in this world understands what it's like to have someone board a flight that never reached its destination and then three years later not know what happened. Also, it's important for us to have an association to put up a united front. After almost two and a half years, the search for Malaysia Airlines Flight 370 has ended. Australia, China and Malaysia have agreed to suspend the deep sea search for missing Malaysia Airlines Flight MH370 on Tuesday. Kemarin menyatakan pencarian terhadap pesawat MH370 dihentikan. Well, as we all know that the search has been suspended already and that means there's no ship out there looking for the plane. Search on 3.0 is actually to create awareness among the public that MH370 is still missing and we have no idea what happened to it. So for us, the search on team begun ever since the plane disappeared. And unfortunately, it's been a continuing theme that we want the search to continue. It is, it's literal, the meaning is literal, that we want the search to go, keep going on. This is also in order to help aviation. When, when it first happened, everybody has a standard operating procedure. But first time happening in Malaysia, so it went topsy-turvy crazy. Nobody knew how to give you any answers and all that. And we hope that with finding the plane, with finding the answers to why the plane ended up where it is or why it ended its flight or why it turned around, we believe that these answers can prevent similar accidents from happening in the future. It's important to know that there hasn't been any mechanical failure on a Boeing. For example, if there is a mechanical failure, then an entire fleet of Boeing should be called back and that mechanical defect should be repaired. But until until we find this plane, then we don't know what happened to it. How do we prevent something like this from happening again? It should not remain a mystery. It should not go down in the history book as a mystery. Everyone wants answers. So we've created a petition. It's called the Search On Petition and we hope that more and more people will sign this petition. I know a lot of people don't know how they can help this cause, although they might feel for the cause or although they may understand that there is an absolute need to find this plane. And I think that the petition is a way that the general public can help support the Search On cause. It's the, a way for them to sa support safer air travel, safer air carriage, which applies to everyone. So we need everyone to support this event. So, I mean, it's not only just for us, it's for everyone out there, the public the travellers and all. First, if everyone signs a petition, then I know that they care. If they all come forward, as I said, the governments will realise that this is very, very important for them to find their own countrymen and also for aviation when they find the aircraft and to put this MH370 at rest, at peace. Because I truly believe that everyone can help make a change. I truly believe that every signature will count. And I truly believe that the more importantly this is taken, the more seriously that it is taken, the closer we will get to finding that solution. And the safer we will be every time we get on a plane. I can never relax when I get on a flight anymore because I never know if I'm going to reach my destination. And I feel similarly for anyone I care about that boards a flight. I can't help this awful paranoia that I feel every time someone's in a plane. And I think that this can all be prevented because I know what it feels like and I really don't want this to be visited upon anyone else. I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. We want to know. I want to know. I want to know. I want to know.
I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. We want to know. We want to know. I want to know. I want to know. Malaysia wants to know. And the world wants to know.